Okay, everyone, the TikTok bill has made its way through the House. Let's go right to Julie Serkin. What happened? What are the results? Yeah, Alex, I'm keeping an eye on my phone because right now they're actually in the second vote in terms of this foreign aid package. Remember, there are four overall, three of them that actually concern foreign aid. The other one is TikTok, which, as you noted, actually just passed a couple of moments ago. The vote total was 360 to 58. About an equal number of Republicans to Democrats actually voted against it, 25 Republicans to be exact, and 33 Democrats, but still a resounding approval for this piece of legislation. We knew that it would turn out this way because a couple of weeks ago, the House actually took up a TikTok bill that was very similar, except the timeline in which the uh, Chinese parent company of TikTok, ByteDance, has to divest, meaning sell the app, uh, now in this bill is up to a year. In the last one, it was six months. That's a change that is welcome for Senate Democrats who can control that chamber and also President Biden in the White House. Hey, everyone. MSNBC has a new and improved app. You'll get real-time alerts and analysis, live blogs, in-depth essays, video highlights and the best 2024 election coverage. Download the new MSNBC app. Here's how to do it. You tap on the app store on your phone. You hit search on the bottom right corner. You type in MSNBC. You click on the MSNBC app. You click on get or the cloud icon and enjoy it.